Hello and welcome to Infinity. There's a little adjustment hiding away that's rather strange. And I just thought I'd, I'd have an experiment with it. I'll just play with it and see what I can find out. And it filters colours solarize. Because there's no three dots after it, that means it's just going to do it straight off, no controls, bang. And you've got sort of a partial inversion. It's sort of bits of it, you know, are, are inverted bit not. It's rather strange. Um, it comes from techniques that were used in the darkroom, so it's sort of emulating some of the things you can do there, apparently. So let's have a look more at what it does with this. So we've got solid colours here, saturated, fading to black, fading to white, and fading to grey. Let's see what happens if we solarise this. Filters, colours, solarise. Ah, that's interesting. White has gone black. Black stays black. Saturated colours by themselves go black. And when you fade to black, halfway down, you're keeping the original colour here, but fading to white, you've got the inverse. So, you, so red goes to cyan, green goes to magenta and so on. And when you're fading to grey, all colour is lost. Isn't that curious? Let's try a few things and see what we can do with it that's useful. So I'm just going to hit Control J to duplicate the layer and we'll do a solarize on this. Filters, colors and solarize. And what we've got here is kind of interesting texture being put into this. So this is something where you've got sort of variable texture in here. See the original there was sort of, it was textured, but this adds a bit of colour into that texture. And if you say you like that, and this is just going to make this picture a bit more interesting, we don't want it on the person here. So we just do a mask layer. And on that, on that mask, I want to paint in black to protect, to so basically punch a hole through so you can see the original underneath. So I take a paintbrush, and I'm just going to, what have I got up here? Opacity 100, hardness 50. That'll do, I'm just going to do it roughly. You can paint on them here. So you go back to the original. There you go. That's good enough. I can also also hit, uh, if I haven't quite got stuff, I can fill things in. I can hit X to go to Y to paint things back out, which is why you do a, a mask on it, because you can always reverse it. So there you go. That's one. Let's have a look at another one here. So here we've got a landscape. And if I control J, duplicate it. Filters, colors, solarize. And the thing you can do here is, uh, which I'll often do, you can, you can try inverting it, which is another something, but just scroll down these, because it automatically shows them, sees what interesting things you can do. So screen, that's quite interesting. That sort of brightened it up, isn't it? So there's one thing you could do. Um, that sort of burns things out. What about overlay? Overlay is quite interesting, isn't it? So, um, what else was I going to do? Ah, oh, yeah, let's just go scroll down here. Exclusion. Now that's kind of interesting too, because that's changing the colour in the sky. But it's a bit overdone. So what you do here is if you pull down the opacity, it's another classic thing to do. If you've got an interesting effect, it's rather ex exaggerated. Play with the opacity and just turn it to where you like. So now we've got an interesting, see, before and after colour change effect. And it's just sort of doing that. So with skies, you can do interesting things. And let's do one more. Control J here. And it very much depends upon the picture because the effect that Solarize has varies massively. So I'll do filter colors so rise and I'm gonna go down here. This one here. So in the in the lightened ones, it gradually gets lighter. So color George or add. So you say to add. What we've got is a burned out thing, but importantly, skin tones are pretty much kept. So you can see the subject here, but everything else has this this very burned effect. So there you go, three very different things that you can do. Solarize, what it does, interesting but predictable. Adding texture, 
playing with skies and doing a burn. Thank you very much for watching.